Hi folks, it's Mike Murphy, and today's quick tip is in ScreenFlow 10. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to batch export. With batch export, you can take several ScreenFlow documents and export them or render them out all at the same time. To batch export in ScreenFlow 10, just make sure that ScreenFlow is open and it is the active application. Go up to the top menu, go to File, Batch Export. When you see this dialog box, you'll see here on the left sidebar, Documents. All you need to do is just add ScreenFlow documents to this left sidebar here. You can do so if you come down to the bottom left, you can just click on the plus symbol, navigate to the files on your hard drive. You can select them one by one or multiple files. Click on Open to add them to the sidebar. You can also just drag and drop ScreenFlow documents right into the sidebar. So I'm just gonna select these here in this folder and drag it right onto that sidebar and that will load those up. If you want to delete documents, you can select them one by one and just click on this little minus key in the bottom left, or you can select multiple files and click on the minus key. And to re-add them, I'm just gonna select them and drag them right into that document sidebar. Once you have loaded all of the ScreenFlow documents that you want to batch export or render out together, come over to the right side and first choose an output folder. Where do you want to save the files once they're done exporting? Just click on choose, select the destination of your choice and click on choose. Select a preset that you want applied to all of the documents. You can also click on customize to customize any of the options. You can choose a scale percentage or click on scale to custom size and enter in the exact dimensions that you want your rendered videos. Once you have the export settings completed, Click on Begin to start the batch export process. You will see a progress bar for each of the individual documents, so where they are at in the export process. And you will also see a progress bar or a status of all the documents, so you can see how much time is left. Now you can go back into ScreenFlow and continue working or editing another video, and the batch export process will run in the background. So the batch export has completed. These were all ScreenFlow documents to start. And if I go into the output folder that I selected here, I can see that they've all been exported as MP4 files. So now I can upload these to my YouTube channel. And that is how to batch export in ScreenFlow 10. My name is Mike Murphy. Cheers.